Nice. This is a demonstration of the Hummingbird Twitter automation software. Right now I have the software open, the logistical web browser. The first thing we're going to do is uh, log into our Twitter account. Hummingbird loves to store an, an unlimited number of Twitter accounts, so uh, I'm going to log into my daughter's Twitter account here. There we go. Uh, we are now in Sally Chow's Twitter account. Uh, now we got to add some followers. Go to Tools, Find Targeted Followers. And in this demonstration, in this case, uh, Sally is interested in toys. So we're going to search for toy Twitter users. There we go. Here's a search results for toys. Hmm. Adam sex toys. I guess that's not good to follow, but there you go. Most popular toys. Sounds good right there. 1,500 followers. Click on that. Click following 1,523. 1,550 following them. So we'll click on the their followers. So these are all the people who are following most popular toys. Normally, if you're a normal Twitter user, you want to follow everyone, you got to click follow, 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 and do that for everyone on the list, and then go next page, next page to follow everyone. What Hummingbird does is it does all that for you automatically. All you got to do is just click this follow all button, and it will go to work. The cool thing about this, because Hummingbird follows the way you would follow, it does not make use of the Twitter API. So you can actually follow as fast as it wants. If you won't exceed the Twitter API, and Twitter won't ban you for spamming or anything like that. Because the Twitter, this is somebody on the, on the Twitter website just clicking follow. So it's doing just the way you would do it. And after it gets done with the first page, you automatically click next page and go on the next page. And it will follow everybody until the entire list has been exhausted or you hit your daily follow limit. So uh, well, I'll wait for this and it goes to the next page so you can see how it works. There you go. It's all nice on the next page. So I'm going to stop this now just because you get the idea how this thing works. All right. So what you would do now is you would wait about, you know, 24, 48 hours for those people to follow you back. And then afterward, you would just go to your Twitter account and you would go to your following, that's you, See, these are the people that you're following. They haven't followed me back yet because I, you know, they haven't given me much time. So what, to unfollow them, you just click unfollow all. And Hummingbird will automatically unfollow everyone who is not following you. In addition to that, you can also protect certain users, like right here, uh, the tools, protect the mutual follower. That means basically protect mutual followers means do not unfollow people who are following you. Protect previously unfollow. This is a very, very important one right here. When you have that chosen, Hummingbird will remember who you unfollow. So if you ever come across them again, it will not follow them. A lot of scripts don't memorize who you unfollow. So not a lot of time you unfollow the person and then you go find someone else. You follow them again because they're following another person and then you unfollow them, follow them again. They might report you for spamming if you do that. Hummingbird, Hummingbird will remember who you want to follow, so you will not follow them again. There's also a, uh, a VIP section. This VIP allows you to uh, enter the names of people who are not following you, but you do not want to unfollow them. You know, it might be CNN News or whatever, so you don't follow anybody. But And when you use Hummingbird to unfollow people, you want to not unfollow them. So you can enter these people into a VIP list. Hummingbird will not unfollow them, even if they're not following you. So. I'll show you how this works right now. You just click unfollow all. And again, Hummingbird will just unfollow everyone who's not following you. And again, it does it the same way you would do it. It does not make use of the API at all. So you're not going to get in trouble with Twitter by abusing the API. And that's Hummingbird, Twitter automation tool.